As a traveler and rail enthusiast, I invite you to embark on a journey with me as we explore the revolutionary Vande Metro train and uncover what sets it apart from conventional memo trains. Are you ready? First of all, let's understand why Vande Metro was developed when we already have memo trains which run on the same basic principle of electric multiple units. We will try to learn the difference from engineering perspective for both the trains. So let's begin. The first and foremost difference is Vande Metro operates on induction motor of squirrel cage design whereas Memo operate on DC series wound motors. Now this makes a lot of difference as induction motor especially squirrel cage design is most rugged motor so far which demands very less maintenance and they are very reliable. As against to that DC motor with its commutator needs a lot of maintenance. That is the basic reason that Bangalore Metro or Kolkata Metro although runs on DC third rail system but the traction motor is induction motor. The second difference is the formation of basic unit. In Vande Metro each basic unit comprises of four coach with two motor car, one driver car and one trailer coach. Now in Memu, each basic unit comprises of two coaches with one motor car and one trailer coach. But in terms of number of traction motor, both are same. In Vande Metro, each motor car has two bogey. Each bogey has two axle with one traction motor on each axle. So a 12 car formation will have 24 traction motors. Similarly, in Memu train, each motor car has two bogey. Each bogey has two axle with one traction motor on each axle. So a 12 car formation will have 24 traction motor. Although the number of traction motors are same, but the traction motor rating are different. So here comes the third difference, which is the rating of the traction motor. In Vande Metro, each traction motor is rated as 274 kilowatt at 1950 RPM, providing 1342 Newton meter of torque. Whereas in Memu train, each traction motor is rated as 167 kilowatt at 1260 RPM, providing 1265 Newton meter of torque. If you want to understand operationally what is the difference, a 12 car formation of Memu train can carry 3300 passengers hauling at a speed of 49 km per hour average speed and 110 km per hour peak speed. Whereas a Vande Metro can carry 3360 passengers hauling at an average speed of 54 km per hour and peak speed of 130 km per hour. Apart from that, we have seen many other special features in the Vande Metro train which are not available in Memu train. For example, the air conditioning system. Although this is also true that ICF had supplied air conditioned coaches to Mumbai suburban trains which are operational both in central and western lines. In summary, Vande Metro stands out to its emphasis on speed, comfort, advanced technology and overall passenger experience making it more suited for urban and semi-urban connectivity with a focus on reducing travel times and improving comfort. Thanks for watching. Like, share and comment on the video. Thank you.